Greetings everybody who clicked on this video. I am xxxman360 and I am going to be showing you a tutorial on how to edit the PVR images in modern Angry Birds versions such as 4.0.0 and I decided to do this uh, because I ha have not came across a video on how to do this on YouTube yet but if there is please do not be a prick in the comments and say xxxman360 you copied so and so. Besides, some people might like one's tutorial better than another. Anyway, so what you're going to need are a um, photo editor of your choice. I preferably use paint.net. Uh, you can then uh, use also, you can also use GIMP. Uh, that also works too. Uh, what you're also going to need is a PVR text tool and HXD. I will leave the links to that in the description so you can get them. And uh, so, where you want to go first is data. Uh, images is where most of the stuff you're going to edit is. And then uh, anything underscore PC is where you should probably look. Um, uh, there's also some stuff that's used in the base section, but uh, uh, for this tutorial, we're going to uh, look at here. So you got achievements, sheet backgrounds, uh, cutscenes. Uh, what else do we got? Menu results screen. Uh, yeah, so quite a lot, actually. Let's take a look at menu elements. Uh, so what you're going to do is you're going to open up PVR text tool, or you can also just set uh, the default extension of PVR to open with PVR text tool. That would also be fine. Uh, okay, so then with PVR text tool, uh, you're going to take your PVR file and drag it in here. Okay, so this looks like the, uh, uh, the some of the things in the credits. And also the uh, the scores. Okay. So how we're going to uh, edit this is we're going to go to File and Save Image. And we're going to save it as PNG. So we're going to also save it as the same name as the original, but just with a different extension. So, um, menu elements underscore one, menu elements one dot P and G. Save. We can now close out of that. And then we go to this dat file. Uh, we're going to open up HXD. Or you can also have dat files by automatically set to open them with HXD. I mean, you should probably do that if you're going to do this consistently. And then you're going to take your dat file and look at the very beginning where you see the .pvr file <laughs> extension. And you're just going to rename that to PNG. Save that. Close out of that. You can delete this back file if you want because uh, you're going to be using the PNG image now, not the PVR. And then you can simply edit the PNG image. So here we are in paint.net. Uh, I will just do something simple like a simple hue change. Yeah, and then make it really saturated. Or, yes, yes, oh so yeah. Yeah, that's funny. Okay, now we can save it. And when we go back to the game, we should notice the changes that have occurred. And at the bottom, yeah. Yep, there it is. Okay, and if we go to a level, we should notice the uh, the different number scores. And as you can see, it's uh, bright green now. So yes, that is a simple tutorial on how to edit any of the PVR files in Angry Birds. And uh, if you're doing a mod for 
uh, mobile versions or any kind of other version of Angry Birds that also uses PVRs, this method will work for that too. But it's just commonly uh, noticed that uh, PVR files occur more in the modern versions. And thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed.